Right now, though, it is time to reveal the next celeb joining this year's Strictly. Well, so far, the lineup includes our very own Ranveer Singh, Nicola Adams, Caroline Quentin, amongst others. And the latest name announced this morning is comedian Bill Bailey, but joining them is going to be... JJ Chalmers. JJ is a former Marine, a TV presenter, and Invictus Games medalist who counts Prince Harry as one of his pals. JJ, it's so good to see you. How are you doing? Uh, it's all just become very real. That's what's yes, when you hear that music, it's like, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> no, that, no. Yeah, that, that music, that unveil, and yeah, the fact that I, I can tell someone that isn't just my mum and dad, basically. I know uh, you've been having to keep this secret to yourself. Now, look, you're an ex-Marine. We know that you were very badly injured in Afghanistan. You've done incredible, heroic, brave things. But Strictly is a whole new level. Yeah, and that's the point, actually. Uh, I'm always looking for a challenge. I'm always looking to push myself outside my comfort zone. Uh, and if I wanted to find a challenge in life, you know, like climbing Everest or going to the North Pole, it, of course those things would be difficult, but they would be within my comfort zone essentially because it's the kind of thing that I'm used to having done in my life. This is completely off the chart. Um, and so, you know, it's going to be a huge challenge. I'm really looking forward to learning something brand new. No, absolutely. Will you be embracing the fake tan and the spangles and the glitter and the pink cat suits? Well, I was a Royal Marine, so of course. Uh, <laughs> yeah, obviously you know, you will. Especially, especially <laughs> on a Thursday night. Uh, oh, yeah, of course. I mean, I think if you've got to go into one of these things, you've got to give it everything. And, you know, that is from a, a physical point of view, a mental point of view. You know, I'm going to immerse myself in this process. Uh, and to be able to do that, I guess I've got to go, uh, you know, whole hog with all the costumes, glitter, Absolutely. everything else. Full bling, full bling. Now, look, because of the injuries that you suffered in Afghanistan, and I know how stoic you are and you just get on with it, I know you do, but it will be a little bit more difficult for you and whoever you're partnered with, you know, the choreography is going to have to sort of take that into account. Yeah, and ultimately that's going to be down to whoever I get partnered with. Uh, they're going to have the work cut out, essentially. Um, we're, we'll figure it out. Uh, but on the flip side... I'm actually hoping, you know, just looking at myself on the telly right now, I can tell I've got terrible posture. Uh, and that's because of my injuries. That's because of the way that I have to, you know, work around it. Um, so the idea that this might, you know, improve my rehab, continue my levels of fitness, you know, that's going to make a big difference to me. Sure. Um, but, you know, I don't want special treatment, but of course we have to level the playing field uh, so, that it, so that it is fair. No, exactly. It's just like with the injuries to your hand, it might be a wee bit more difficult perhaps to do lifts and things. But do you know what? You and, you and whoever you're with, because all of the pros are so, so good, they'll just work their way around it. And like you said, and I know this is really important to you, you don't want any special treatment. You just want to be treated like everybody else. That's very, very important, isn't it? Yeah, that's, that, that is it at the heart of it. And yeah, I mean, I've... I've, I've been in touch with my own surgeon, my physios. Uh, we put together a bit of a team that's going to help hold me together. Um, but yeah, I, I just want to, I want to, you know, I'm on this show not because I got blown up, not because I was a, an Invictus Games medalist. You know, yes, it's because I've managed to get to this level in my career as a presenter. Sure. Uh, but ultimately, I just want to come along and give it my absolute everything. Oh, it's such a good show. I can't wait to see what you're going to bring to it because, like, everything that you do, you know, you just put your heart and soul into it. You really do. Now, we've said already, obviously, close to Prince Harry. Do you think he's going to be watching on the old BBC iPlayer and uh, maybe be giving you some advice? Yeah, I don't know how that works. I don't know if you can get it in LA. Yeah. We'll probably have to watch Dancing with the Stars. Oh, that's um, true. But uh, I, know, I know from, you know, Mutual friends like Dave Henson, who competed at the Paralympics, that of course he was watching him, you know, when he completed, competed and won his bronze medal there. And so I think he's going to follow. Uh, and, and I think, you know, I think he's going to have a great laugh, first and foremost. He's going to react like anybody else, you know, anybody else in that picture, for that matter, any of the guys that I was once in the military with. Uh, but also when he considers, you know, that he really is a cornerstone in creating this opportunity because he created the Invictus Games. For sure. Uh, it, the idea that you know, this this is a culmination of 10 years of my recovery, essentially, uh, and he's been a big, big part of that. And so, you know, he should take some massive pride in the fact that one of his lads has gone on to achieve this sort of 
uh, level within their new chosen field, because that's the point of Invictus, you know, to rehabilitate us, to give us a new passion, new goal, and actually a belief in ourselves that yeah. we were worth opportunities that came our way. Uh, and so I'll give this my all, and yeah, I hope he's watching. Yeah, and you're a shining example of that, you really are. What was the reaction from the family? Because like you said, you could hardly tell anybody about this. I mean, were they, were they pleased or, or, or shocked or what? Yeah, it, it's both. The, the initial <laughs> reaction, and it's going to be the case, particularly once my phone starts ringing after this and all the Marines <laughs> get in touch, is that it, it's it's ridiculous. And it, it absolutely is. It's because it Strictly is wonderful and mad and all those great things. But, you know, 10 years ago, I was just standing in a dust box in Afghanistan. This was never a consideration, never a dream. But actually, when you look at sort of what I've done over the last four or five years, it, it has become, you know, it begins to make sense sure. that, uh, how I've managed to get myself to this position. And I spoke to my surgeon who said, if you told me, you know, eight years ago that you would try and climb Everest, I would have believed that. Uh, this is just completely insane. But at the same time, actually, having sort of followed you, it makes sense. It does. <laughs> it, it makes perfect sense. It, it really does, JJ. I think it's a brilliant thing. And your wee girl is going to absolutely <laughs> love seeing her dad dancing. It's going to be good. Yeah, so I just told her last night, actually. So she just started back at her dance class last night. So she you know, hasn't been doing that for six months, has massively missed it. We've been dancing around this kitchen pretty much uh, throughout lockdown. And so I told her last night and her reaction was sort of disbelief again. But then she said, you're going to have to get your teacher to show you this. And she got up and started showing me some moves. Aww. She says, you've got to do your exercises as well. <laughs> um and then she went off to bed and the first thing she said to me this morning was, have you learned to dance yet? So <laughs> it's a bit pressure. more complicated than that. <laughs> pressure, pressure. JJ, can't wait to see you. Congratulations. I think you're going to be an amazing addition. Um, and, and like I say, I can't wait to see what you're going to bring to the show. Thank you so much for joining us. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Brilliant. Thank you so much. Oh, what a great guy. And that will help so many people too. Inspirational. Don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.